We'll guide you through how you can restart your iPhone without touchscreen. Let's get right into this. You may find that your iPhone is frozen and you're trying to go and restart it, but of course you can't because the touchscreen isn't working. Well, that's exactly what this guide is for, or you may just want to know how you can restart your iPhone without the touch. But anyways, I'm gonna show you how you can do it. So there are two different ways to do this, and that's gonna depend on what version of iPhone you're using. So if you're using an iPhone 8 or newer, so that's then going to be iPhone 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, and even newer, then what we need to do is go and simply go and press the increase volume button, then the decrease, and then just hold the power button. I'm now gonna do that now. It has to all be done pretty consecutively though, um, so I'm gonna show you how you can do that. So you press volume up, then volume down and then hold the side button like this. You'll then see this screen here. If your iPhone is frozen, you may not see this screen, but don't worry, just keep holding the power button and shortly your iPhone is going to go black. Now that it's gone black, you just need to wait until you see the Apple logo and then you go and release the power button. So I'll now release it and your iPhone is gonna restart. And then just wait and your iPhone is then gonna go and power back on and I can now go and use it again. And just to round up the video for if you're not using an iPhone 8 or newer, maybe you're using an iPhone 7 or a 6S or an older iPhone. So for iPhone 7, all you need to do is press the volume down and the sleep slash wake button and tease the Apple logo as I did there. And if you're using a 6S or an iPhone SE, then all you need to do is hold both the sleep slash wake button and the home button at the same time until the Apple logo appears and then you release. 